Hi, my name is Shay. On this channel, I've done many, many jump rope challenges. Why? Because it works. Duh. So you could say like I'm, a, I'm an expert. You know, you could say that. Every time I'm trying to shed some weight quickly, jump rope is my go-to, and I'm gonna tell y'all why it should be yours too. In this video, watch me torture myself for another two weeks. Yay! Hello. My name is Shay. Welcome to my channel. On this channel, we do fitness program reviews, fitness guide reviews, fitness challenges, comedic twist on all of them, and just lifestyle and health in general. If that's something you're interested in, hit that subscribe button to join the channel. Okay, so today we have a lot. Today we have a lot. It is May 6th. May 6th? It has now been a month of lockdown for the fourth time where I am. Yeah, you can tell my mental health is thriving, uh-huh. I looked in the mirror today and I didn't like what was looking back at me, okay? I did my before pictures. Ugh, no, that is not Shay. That is not Shay. She fell off track. She wasn't meal prepping. She wasn't being as healthy as she usually is. And today I decided I want to make a change. So we have a bunch of May challenges. Today's challenge is a jump rope challenge. Y'all love my jump rope challenges. And it is the fastest way to burn cardio. What? <laughs> it is the fastest way to burn calories so i got one down here we're gonna start jump roping i don't know for how long maybe two weeks i'm not sure but we just gonna get started hey let's get into it <laughs> okay so i set a goal of jumping rope for 10 minutes per day 10 minutes is doable i saved it for the end of my workout as cardio and it really made me feel amazing getting that sweat in felt so good i even learned a few jump rope tricks i saw all the comments i saw them i know y'all be telling me to wear some running shoes and i did and it felt amazing but I'm stubborn as hell and sometimes I just don't want to wear shoes because I personally feel like when I do it makes my calves burn even freaking more okay I can vouch for that this brings me to my tips for you if you're thinking of starting a jump rope challenge number one get a weighted rope this weighted rope is gonna help your form it's a bit heavier and it's gonna help you burn more calories don't be using those flimsy dollar store ropes I'm telling you I just said that and I literally bought my jump rope at the dollar store oh the shade <laughs> number two practice your form you want to jump up and land lightly keyword lightly y'all hear that you want to land on the balls of the front of your feet kind of like on your tippy toes if you look at me i don't put my feet completely down onto the ground like flat i put the timer for 10 hours you want to keep your chest up arms out at your side and jump up lightly did you know that jump rope is a low impact activity right since when did jumping become low impact i don't know it's because you're only jumping so far off the ground so this is perfect for y'all who have them bad joints bad knees yeah trust me because i got them bad knees and i've been doing it tip number three keep an eye on your rest time if you're out of breath and you stop for a few minutes to catch your breath just remember that you're also lowering your heart rate as you do that therefore not burning as much calories what i try to do is keep an eye on the timer and i time my breaks to about 30 seconds it's really easy to lose track of time especially when you're just there dying <laughs> gasping for breath so i just tell you keep that in mind tip number four is more of a statement your calves are going to burn calves have left the chat <laughs> okay so think about jumping you're literally doing calf raises you are constantly using those calf muscles i'm telling you when i first started jump roping my calves hurt so freaking much i could barely walk okay i thought i was injured but it was just me shocking my muscles you know but the good news is that your body eventually gets used to it and it goes away okay because now when i jump rope i don't have that pain no more shut up I'm telling y'all, y'all got 10 minutes a day, man. Like, look at that. 10 minutes. Oh, wow. Like, I sweat like that from like a 45 minute workout. That was 10 minutes. Oh yeah, we gonna do this. Daily. I just want to take a moment to thank today's sponsor. Plant of Life was ever so generous to send me over these products to try and review. They specialize in organic, vegan, I know I got a lot of vegan followers, hey, cruelty-free plant-based CBD products. They're also Canadian and offer free shipping Canada-wide. If you're new to my channel, then you probably don't know, but I have an anxiety disorder and suffer from chronic insomnia. One of the things I experimented with was CBD oil because it's natural and I try to avoid medications when I can. I like to 
do everything naturally. They sent me over a full spectrum organic CBD oil, which is considered a herbal supplement. The packaging definitely caught my eye. It was so beautifully designed. I actually kept the boxes because they were so pretty. These products have no artificial ingredients because you know on this channel, we're conscious of what we put in our bodies, right? The CBD drops also has melatonin, chamomile, lavender, and valerian, all things which help you get a restful night's sleep. As someone who suffers from anxiety, a few drops helps you really turn down the volume of those racing thoughts and helps you get the rest you deserve. I take a few drops before bed and it really helps calm me down and put me in that relaxing state of mind. They also sent me over a CBD heel stick, which, oh my God, smells amazing. It smells like eucalyptus. Since we're doing a jump rope challenge and you've got them sore calves, how can I tell you you're gonna have sore calves without showing you a possible natural solution? This paint stick is so cool. You just twist a bit out and gently rub it on your skin, wherever you feel pain or discomfort. The menthol in the product really gives you that nice cooling sensation on your skin. You can really help calm and soothe your calves. If you're new to my channel, you wouldn't know that my mom broke her wrist this winter and had surgery. She's been in pain daily ever since. I got her to try out this pain stick for a week and now she's practically stealing it from me. So she puts them on before bed or during the day when she has discomfort. It's an amazing product. If you guys would like to check out Plant of Life, I put a link in the description as well as the pinned comment. For each product you buy, they also plant a tree. Thank you, Plant of Life, for sponsoring this video. Let's get back into it. By week two, I was really getting to the hang of it. Setting a more realistic goal for me was key. I was also doing Caroline Gervin's Epic 2 workout program and because her workouts are more strength based and you pretty much do one hit workout a week, I was looking to add a little bit more cardio so I would do her 45 to an hour long workout video and then jump rope at the end when my heart rate was still elevated. I also did the Mr. London Summer Body Ab Challenge. That was really fun. I enjoyed that so much and you definitely need to go check that video out because I'd encourage you to do it too. If you're going to take anything away from this video, it's the fact that doing all these challenges, even though it's good and it gets your body moving maybe motivates you because you find it fun just like me you're not going to see results if you don't have the proper nutrition although i don't diet i do believe in eating a healthy non-restrictive balanced lifestyle i'm not telling you to go eat kale salads but i'm telling you to be conscious of what you put into your body in order to see visible results you have to shed the layer of fat over top Anytime I do an ab challenge, I jump rope because I know this form of cardio, as well as being in a caloric deficit, is gonna get me the results I would like. I post multiple videos showing you my meal prep, I show you my meals. You can also follow me on Instagram, shea.butter. I post my meals on my story pretty much every single day, okay? I've been filming a lot of what I eat in a week videos. Those have been really fun. A lot of people ask me what I eat on these challenges, so I'll do a little food montage. I like to experiment with different recipes. Lately, I've been liking taking high calorie foods and finding low calorie, low fat recipes, aka anabolic. I focus on getting in my daily fruits, veggies, and protein in. I drink a lot of water every single day. That helps my appetite, helps curb it. All in all, I just enjoy my food as well as enjoy the process of working on myself, and you should too. I'm very happy with my results. I got some baby abs. I stand by what I said. Jump rope is the best cardio and the fastest if you want to lose weight. If you got it this far in the video, comment plant of life down below in honor of our sponsor for today. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Bye guys. I'll see you in the next video. Love you. Still you go through all